Hi, okay. Um, so, first of all, I wanted to apologize. Number one, that this is a little later than I wanted it to be. And I also want to apologize for my absence. Life has been crazy. First of all, I've had a lot of acting stuff going on. I've had like workshops and auditions because you know, I'm such a working actor. And also I've had family here over the holidays who I haven't seen in like three years. So it's been, it's been a little hectic. Thank you guys for being patient with me and my ever so failing uploading schedule. Anyway, I'm back. I'm glad to be back. And now today is the long awaited, most requested Christmas haul. <laughs> I know, you're all crying tears of joy. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys what I got for Christmas. I'm not even gonna do the whole, I'm not bragging. Disclaimer, because everyone's heard it, everyone's tired of it, we're just gonna get started. We all know no one's bragging. Stop looking into things so much. Oh my <laughs> Okay, <laughs> let's see what I got for Christmas. You do? All right, I know, let's go. So we're starting off with the stocking, and you guys remember this thing from last year? The size of me. So my dear mother likes to go crazy on the stocking, which I'm very grateful for because it makes it all the more exciting because the stocking is the same size as you. Okay, this is a body scrubber. You use it in the shower and it scrubs. It's really useful. Cute little notebook, useful for notebooking. And then I got this manicure kit, has nail clippers and all kinds of stuff for your nails, which mine didn't need it. And then I got these beauty sponges, beauty blonder, beauty, whatever. Then I got a shower cap. I'm only gonna show you this one longer because it has cactuses on it. And then I got this little set of two bags for like cosmetics and stuff. Good for travel. Then I got anti-cellulite body wash in a sponge with seaweed extract and caffeine. Not sure what to say about that one. And then I got another shower cap because apparently Santa is very keen on me um, not washing my hair. Oh my god, wait. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. Okay. And what this is is a little heating pad that you can put in the microwave and it warms up. It smells like lavender. It's a little hedgehog. He's my friend. And then when I need warmth and love because I don't have anyone to warm me and love me. Then I got this eco-friendly hairbrush. I got some tweezers because my eyebrows need a plucking. I got Olivia Grace. And you know, this reminds me of the time that I changed my channel name to Kaylin Olivia and then everyone thought it was my middle name. Spoiler alert, it's not. What are these called? Loofahs. Shower scrub. Why is everything in this stocking about showering or manicuring? Is this like a sign? That's everything. All right, so now on to the under the tree items. I'm going to do this in categories. So I'm gonna show you guys everything that my parents got me and then I'll show you things from like my friends, my other family, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. I have to start with this because it's just something so dear to my heart. Another one. I could not believe the shock when I opened yet another hedgehog friend. This means everything to me. It's my most prized possession. And then I got this game and it's called the awesome game of meme and it's pretty fun, pretty quirky. Then I got this Calvin Klein perfume, which smells super good. And we all know I love perfume and I like to take baths in it, so. And then I also got more perfume. This one is Guess Girl. And then I got the, uh, you know, basic teenage girl essential. I got a Mario Badescu set and it comes with cleansing gel, facial spray, ma a mask, some powder, which I don't really know what to do with, and then some drying lotion, which is an essential when you have a pimple, which I have on my nose, but don't look. And then to um, really work the skincare products that I just got into my face, I got this Rose Quartz facial roller and then I like use it with face products and I feel like I'm caring about my so self-care and then I got this glass water bottle and this is actually like one of my favorite things I don't know why it's such a simple thing but it has pressed flowers all over it if you can see that I don't know I love pressed flowers so I just think this is so cute it's a little cat clock and it's like the old vintage like old school cat clock so he is a very sophisticated young gentleman and he needs a name because i just i just think it needs to be something that really fits him so look him in the eyes and then i got this adorable laptop case it is so freaking cute it has a bunch of flowers on it i know i'm on a flower kick i love it and then i got this poetry book and it's called every word you cannot say next up i think this is a sign that i need to get my life together and be more organized because i got not one but two planners i've been doing a little decorating i'm no journaler you know but i just i've been putting some stickers feeling artsy you know so uh next up i got not one, not two, not three, not four, but five Lana Del Rey CD. Lana Del Rey CDs because it dawned upon me that I have all of her albums on vinyl records, but none in CDs. So I was like, I 
and use some CDs. Okay, and then y'all are gonna laugh, but laugh all you want because I got this for a very important reason. I got a cordless vacuum. I got this because I have a problem called I eat snacks on my bed and then it leads to crumbs on my bed, which is gross and I don't want ants. Cause who wants ants? Unless you're like some ant enthusiast. I'm not one. So I got this little cordless vacuum and I'm going to use it to clean up my small everyday inconvenient messes that I create in this room of mine. And then along with the very important home devices, uh, I got this. Uh, this is crucial. I don't know what I would do without such a thing. It's a, it's a Bob Ross toaster. This is not just a toaster with Bob Ross on it. This is a toaster that toasts Bob Ross into your toast. And I just don't know if I've ever owned anything better. Um, okay, prop crew, let's calm it down. Let's tone it down a notch. I guess you could say it was a Bob Ross Christmas. Bob, <laughs> we all know how I feel about Bobby boy. He can paint his way to my heart. I'm done. And then I got this, which is very interesting, and I tried it, and it actually works quite well. I was skeptical, but I actually really like it. So it's basically this, it's like a hairbrush that dries your hair, so you brush it through your hair and it blow dries it, and it kind of helps straighten it. Double whammy, so. Okay, and then my mom went a little crazy in the jewelry department. Thank you, mom. So the first set of earrings she got me are these that I've seen everybody wearing, and I have friends that wear them, and I've wanted a pair for a while, and they're super cute. So there are these faces. Is. and they're gold and I don't know I just think they're such a statement piece and then along with the face earrings she got me not one but two face necklaces because I gotta be all faced out you know look like I'm artsier than I actually am so one is gold like the earrings and then one is silver got all the metals and then I got some clothes so I'm gonna show you each thing just quickly I'm not gonna go into depth because otherwise I'll talk for two hours so first up is this black shirt with this girl and she's like and then I got this long sleeve shirt and it has a little embroidered dragon on it and I think it's super cool. And then I got this crop t-shirt that's kind of like a baggy fit and it says natives of the golden coast, which I'm not, but I'll wear a shirt to pretend. I got this hoodie. This is super cool and I love hoodies. And then I got a pair of my favorite kind of pants, which are these like soft plaid-ish, checkered-ish, gingham-ish. I actually have a skirt exactly like this that I posted a picture in. <laughs> Who cares? I got another plaid thing. This one is like a light blue with a darker blue and red lines and it's a cropped. I've wanted a shirt like this for quite some time, so it's super cute. Okay, and this is gonna look a little confusing when I hold it up. So it looks like this. You can tie it like around this way and then tie it in the back or you can tie it in the front or to the side. And it's got this adorable little black and white flower pattern on it. I got this sweatshirt, which I love. It has a painting on it and I think it is super cool. And finally, I got her. I got her, yeah. This denim jacket and that it has furry, faux fur, leopard lining inside is so cute. And it's kind of got like a vintagey look to it and I don't know I've been into leopard and I just really really like it the next thing I got is this little beanie and scarf set and then to go along with the soft things uh dogs look this is what I'm gonna start wearing in my videos so nobody can have a foot fetish okay I think it's a win-win win not just one not two three wins look at this they're slippers by the way in case you missed it. So these are just a teaser trailer into the next item, but I got some Doc Martens. Okay, can I backtrack a second? Does anyone else have the Mandela effect or whatever it's called where something is one thing for like your whole life and then one day you suddenly find out that it's like not like, I can't think of an example. If I think of an example, I won't think of one. So let's just not even start a sentence. I, all my life I've thought it is Doc Martens, right? But it's actually Dr. Martin. I don't know if you would just call it Doc Martens. It's like Doc, short for doctor. I really just thought that's what the brand was called. Like I thought it was just straight up Doc Martens. And then I realized it's Dr. Martens and everything's just been wrong in my life since. So Dr. Martin socks. They're like calf high. So there's a black and yellow pair, a cream and maroon pair, this white and maroon and yellow pair. And I don't know why these remind me of college. <laughs> this leads me into one of my favorite things. Ah! I've wanted these forever. I just think they're so cool. Now that I have them, I'm complete. It's likely that I'm cooler than you. Get a little cocky out here. Okay, and then this was an unofficial Christmas gift. It was supposed to be a Christmas gift, and then my mom didn't wrap it because she wasn't sure how I would feel about it, and then she gave it to me after Christmas. So it's a Christmas gift that I didn't get on Christmas. So it's this adorable leather backpack, which I don't know why she even had doubts on whether or not I would like it, because I love it. I'm a fan. 
And then, I don't know why I just have some interesting story about everything I've gotten for Christmas, but what we have here is what looks like a normal wooden lap desk, right? So, somehow, my parents ordered four of these. Let me rephrase that. My dad ordered four. Hi, dad. My dad ordered four of these. I don't know how he managed to do that. So now uh, we have four lab desks. Maybe I should sell them. So this is something that I'm super excited about because I really, really need it. I used to not be a big jewelry person and then I got... I don't know, I got really into it. It's just, it's become a thing. So now I have a lot of jewelry that I don't have a lot of space to do things with. I got this jewelry organizer and it goes on your wall. I think I'm gonna put it in my closet, but it's so nice. It has a bunch of spots for earrings. It has a bunch of spots to hang like necklaces, bracelets, etc. So this is gonna be super nice and super helpful to organize all my scattered jewelry. So I'm really, really excited to put this to use. So I got this record rack and it is so freaking cool. This is one of my favorite things. I'm so happy about this. So I have a record player stand that has slots at the bottom, but I I was kind of running out of room. Plus, I kind of like to display my records because some of them are really cool, and I think it's cool to display them. Just, I don't know, because I like them. It's what I like. Okay, get over it. And I've draped like some vines over it, and I don't know, I'm just obsessed with it and the way it looks. <laughs> Okay, my absolute favorite thing I got, which I'm most excited about, thank you so much, Mom, I got a guitar. And I was talking about this a couple videos ago that this was like the number one thing on my Christmas list and that I really wanted to learn how to play. It's freaking beautiful. It is so pretty and I just am so obsessed with it and I really just want to stare at it because it's just so, so beautiful. And then finally, the final thing is this here chair. And you might be thinking, Kaylin, why is the chair on the bed? And to that, I will answer you. I don't really have an explanation. The reason I got this chair is because I have this dilemma. I game on my PlayStation, so I'm such a gamer girl, and I can't see my TV screen from my bed. I got this chair so I can comfortably use my PlayStation. It rocks back and forth, and it folds up so it's portable and everything, and I can like put it away when I'm not using it, and it's super useful, so. And she's comfy, I might just leave her up here. I mean, why not, right? So thank you to my parents for all of the wonderful gifts. I love everything so much. And now onto stuff from my extended family. So I'm gonna start off with stuff from my Gammy, and she was here this Christmas, which was really fun. And so she got me some cool stuff, and I'm gonna show you, which I'm gonna start with my favorite thing. This super awesome retro cassette player, and it also does like a radio, but I don't know, I just love it. It's so cool, and it looks so awesome in my room, and I'm absolutely obsessed with it. And then she got me this Philosophy Amazing Grace perfume. I'm scared of this, but I'm very anxious to try it. She got me an epilator, and I've heard that these are super painful. If you don't know what it is, it's like a hair removal device, and I personally hate shaving my legs. It's just a pain. So I'm gonna try this, see if it works. She got me this shirt, and I have one like this in green, and it's one of my favorite shirts, so now I have a red and blue one. I got this Tommy Hilfiger fleece jacket, and it goes so well with the shirt, and it's fleece, and I am obsessed with fleece jackets. Like, obsessed. Like, I have like 30, so now I have 31. So thank you so much. Gammy. I love everything. Now we're gonna move on to my Aunt Lish, who was also here for Christmas. She got me this pink t-shirt with a butterfly on it because butterflies are like her favorite thing, so she thought it was fitting and it's adorable. And then to go with it or just to wear in general because I live in shorts like this, she got me this black pair of just like soft casual shorts and then Wait for it. Another fleece jacket! So it's gray and fuzzy and super soft. And then one of the coolest things I got because it's just so unique and definitely the coolest thing she got me. When I opened this on Christmas, I was just like really shocked because it was such a cool unique gift. She actually went on a trip earlier this year to Morocco and while she was there, she found this for me for Christmas. It is a really freaking cool geode and oh my God, this is quite possibly the coolest thing ever. Oh my god, isn't that so pretty? So thank you so much, Aunt Lish. I'm so grateful for everything. And then, as I've said in the years past, every year my dad's side of the family does a secret Santa. And somehow my cousin Haley has ended up with me every year. I think she's cheating. Actually, I know she's cheating. She told me she's cheating. Haley, I'm looking at you. So she got me. Shocker. She got me this Bath and Body Works set, and it's Christmas cocoa and mint, and it smells like mint chocolate chip. And then she got me these really pretty earrings, and they're Kendra Scott. Okay, I don't know if it picks up on camera, but these are actually like iridescent, and they're they're just so pretty. So, thank you, Haley. From my best friend, Brooke, you all know Brooke, uh, she got me quite a few things, so I'm gonna show you guys everything. The first thing she got me is this velvet notebook, and it says Leo on it because that's my star sign. And then this next thing is like a little set goes together. First thing is this phone case, and it's clear with white pressed flowers, and we all know I've been into pressed flowers, as I've been saying. The best part about it is it goes along with this Polaroid case, and I love this, and it goes really well with my white Polaroid, so. 
And then she got me this Fleetwood Mac shirt because we are standing Fleetwood Mac, okay? Also, we listen to Fleetwood Mac like every time we're together. Okay, and this is actually Loki from Brooke's dad. We love Skinny Dave. He's been in some videos. Everyone stands him. He bought me this because Brooke is a, a DC stan and I'm a Marvel stan, so she refuses to buy me Marvel merchandise, which fine or whatever uh, so her dad buys it for me instead because he's my friend so thanks Dave um, and then earlier you saw Bob fly because he just has magical qualities but Brooke got me this too but you wouldn't know that because he was he just came in at the wrong time Bob you gotta get your schedule straight and then Brooke got me two records so the first one we have Billy eyelash it's Billy eyelash so now we can put the the I'm the bad guy duh on vinyl, on, on the record player. This one is actually a movie soundtrack. It's from the movie Booksmart, if anyone has seen it. It's a movie we watched together and we just really liked the movie, so she got me the vinyl of the soundtrack, which I think is super cute, so. Thank you, very thoughtful. And then she gave me this sweatshirt and it says, don't call me angel, and then it has an angel, or a cherub angel thing. Yes, that. This is because of the song with Lana Del Rey and then Ariana Grande and Miley Cyrus, but that's not the point called Don't Call Me Angel, and it's, you know, unofficial merch. I'm kidding about Ariana and Miley. Don't yell at me, stands, please. Uh, it was a joke, please. <laughs> anyway. And then she got me this vase. <laughs> got me this vase, and uh, we might have to censor this. She's sending nudes. It's this bodice, and I, I think this is really cool, actually. I put this plant in it because I love plants, and I think it's a really cool piece. And then, Arguably the best thing that Brooke got me, which I literally was not expecting this at all. It was the last thing I would have expected. I have really prided myself on my wired headphone use. Even last Christmas, I was given a wireless headset and I went on about how I'm not bougie. I'll never have AirPods. I'm not an AirPods girl. I'm sure I've said things about it on my Instagram story. I just really hyped up the wired headphones because I didn't want to follow the, the, the pack, you know? I wanted to be different. But now I have AirPods. Thanks, Brooke. Now I'm no longer different. I'm just kidding. I actually really like them. I I I I am I I regret to say that I absolutely love them and I've used them every single day and I'm, I'm now converted to AirPod is and I'm really sorry if you use wired headphones and you're disappointed just know that I still love you but I love these more first of all AirPods second of all the best part about said AirPods are they are in this case and this case is none other than a boba cup um so now the moment you've all been waiting for I know you never thought you'd see the day but I'm going to put the AirPods in the ears and you're gonna see me transform from a basic teenage girl to rich Oh, hello darling. Oh, uh, yes. Oh, <clears throat> sorry. I can't hear you. I'm airborne. <laughs> First of all, thank you so much, Brooke, for making me a rich girl. Thank you for converting me. I think I just turned Australian. No. <laughs> I'm gonna say goodbye now. I'll stop being British, I guess. Um, if you're British, let me know how bad my accent was. Scale of 1 to 10. I'm gonna go with a 3. Anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching my What I Got for Christmas. I love you. Thank you again for being patient with me, and I hope you guys enjoyed seeing What I Got for Christmas. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. And if you want to be notified every time I upload, you should definitely turn on the little post notification bell. And also follow me on Instagram. It's Kayla Mulkins, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>